Thin film is a little bit different technology for constructing photovoltaic panels. They have some advantages and they also have some disadvantages. Basically the advantage is lighter weight and flexible design so they can be molded to different, to different shapes. However, in this case, they are mounted in sort of traditional panels, but you can see that they are basically one solid sheet for each of the modules. Now, thin film disadvantage is that it's not as efficient a solar panel. For the same area of panel, the more traditional solar panel generates more energy per area than this type of panel. So this is less efficient. You get less electricity for the same surface area. The other thing we'd like to look at on this particular application is the way these panels have been mounted on this roof's slope. This roof has a slope which is about 45 degrees. Very atypical, unusual for a roof but the panels have been mounted on this very steep roof, so it has a tilt pointing toward the sun angle of 45 degrees. 45 degrees for Las Cruces means these are gonna be pointing towards the sun better in the winter, but less efficiently in the summer when their sun is more overhead. A better tilt angle for Las Cruces would be the same as the latitude about 30, 35 degrees. So this is too steep traditionally for these types of panels. But you can see that even on a very high slope, we can still mount these panels and get pretty good results from them. The other thing we want to look at is that this particular roof structure, we've mounted the panels and the roof itself has some air channels because you want to keep the panels cool as possible. Heat makes the panels less efficient. The higher the heat, the less efficient they are. So getting air to pass over them and air to pass under them is always a good thing to do. If you're mounting them on a roof, you also want to be careful that you are connected correctly. Mounting onto a roof, obviously you want to be careful about going through the roof, creating places for water to enter, so you want to make sure they're sealed correctly. But for the most part, you want to mount them off the roof so that you get air circulation around them. You can see that they've been spaced out, allowing air circulation lifted off the roof surface. The preceding was a production of New Mexico State University. The views and opinions in this program are those of the author and do not necessarily represent the views and opinions of the NMSU Board of Regents.